welcome to my channel so today's video is another monthly favorite video and I have done two of them I decided to do this kind of video every single month because you know what I have been trying out so many new products every now and then and some of them are really really good and some of them are like uh, you know so I think these products need a shout out from my side because they are amazing and I have been uh, using these products every single day you know so these products are really really good so yeah without further ado let's get started but before starting if you are new here then hi I am Nita I upload makeup skincare and beauty related videos almost every alternative day please take a moment to subscribe to my channel for that press that red subscribe button right here and also press the bell icon next to it so that you get notification whenever I upload a new video so yeah without further ado let's get started so first I'm going to talk about this Rimmel Stay Matte Pressed Powders and I have two of them. This is in the shade Nude Beige and this is in the shade Transparent. I love both of them. Whenever I'm wearing makeup, I set my entire makeup with the shade Transparent. It does not alter the shade of my foundation or my concealer. It just sets my makeup beautifully and it makes my makeup long lasting it's not patchy it's not overly powdery it just makes everything look so flawless i love this stuff and whenever i'm not wearing any makeup i just want something to brighten up my face i uh, use this shade called nude beige and it just instantly brightens up my face which i absolutely love and i think people with normal to oily skin will love this compact i have kind of dry skin still i enjoy these two compacts these are so so good and these are also budget friendly so yeah go for it this is these are so so good next i have here two nail polishes from la colors and these are from their pastel collection this is in the shade popsicle and this is in the shade buttercup first of all i love two shades this one is a very nice greenish yellowish color which is perfect for summers and this is a very nice shade of pink and I absolutely love this color and you have probably seen uh, me wearing this color in one of my videos. This is so so stunning. And the best part is these are for 93 cents each. Yes, these are not even one dollar. These are 93 cents and I got them from Walmart. And when I got them, I was not really expecting this quality from these nail polishes. You know, the formula is so, so good. It is so richly pigmented. You just need one swipe to cover your nails and it lasts on my nails for about three to four days without chipping and if I use a top coat it lasts about six to seven days and I have tried so many nail polishes nail paints from Sally from uh, OPI AC CYO sinful colors but this formula guys this formula just shocked me you can totally compare these to all those expensive nail polishes these are so so good so if you spot them at Walmart or Dollar Generals or Dollar Tree just grab them these are so good next up that I have here is this essence volume stylist lash extension mascara and I got it from Ulta about three weeks ago and I instantly fell in love with this mascara this is so so good I think essence knows their mascara game I have tried so many essence mascaras and they have never ever failed me this mascara is so so good and this is what I'm wearing right now on my lashes you can totally see it is so so good it just separates my lashes beautifully it just gives my lashes a very nice volume and the wand is so so good look at this I mean the bristles the middle part is a bit fat and the sides are a bit like thin so this kind of wand is perfect for my lower lashes and of course I love the formula and everything so yeah it is for like four dollars if you spot this one just grab it it is so good next i have here this candlelight waterproof gold kajal from rimmel london and this is in the shade 003 brown love the formula of these eyeliners it glides on smoothly on my waterline and it stays all day long and it is smudge proof waterproof this is so good and i love the color 
I love the color. This is like the perfect warm brown eyeliner and this is such a brown that actually looks like brown because I have tried some eye pencils, brown eye pencils. They literally look black on me. If you look very closely, then probably you can make out that I'm wearing a brown eye pencil but it does not do that. It is a rich brown eye pencil. I was searching for a good brown eye pencil because you know what? There was a time when a black kajal pencil was a staple product in my makeup regime and I would wear a black kajal pencil on my waterline every single day. But nowadays I'm like, you know what? Give me a break. I need something softer and something subtle on my waterline that, that will not look harsh, that will give my eyes a nice definition at the same time. And that's when I spotted this guy and I fell in love with it. And I have been wearing this kajal pencil every single day on my waterline. and. This is what I'm wearing right now on my waterline and you can see it is stunning. The only thing that I do not like about this eye pencil is the packaging because I have to like sharpen it and I do not like to sharpen my eye pencils or lip pencils. I prefer a retractable one and I wish, I wish it would come in a retractable form. That's it. That's the only drawback of this eye pencil. Other than that, it is a great product. Next I have here this Maybelline Master Studio Contour Kit in the shade medium to thick. I recently did my signature makeup look using only this palette as my bronzer, blush and highlight and this is what I'm wearing right now on my face as well as on my eyes. You can go ahead and check that video out. I will link that video over there so you can go ahead and check that out. This palette is so good. This is like outstanding. I have this palette for so long but I don't know why I was not really using this palette religiously but recently I started using this palette and I was like why? Why I just stopped using this palette? This is so good. I mean the bronzer, the blush and the highlight. Everything in this palette is so so good. The bronzer is a very nice warm tone brown color which is perfect for contouring as well as for like warming up my face and the blush is so so good. It is not a matte blush. It has a nice sheen to it which gives my cheeks a very nice glow, healthy glow which I absolutely love and the highlighter oh my god it is like blinding it is blinding at first i was like maybe it's a subtle highlight but when i started using it with my finger i was amazed it is a blinding highlight and you can see i'm wearing this highlighter right now on my cheeks it is freaking blinding and another great thing about this palette is the colors are so universal it they will work on every skin tone and the blush, the highlighter, if you want a very subtle kind of look, you can just wear maybe one or two layers. And if you want a bang on blush or a bang on beaming highlight, you can layer it up and you will have that. This is so good. And this is perfect for the beginners. Because you know what? It's so affordable. If you want to get a separate blush, highlight or a separate um, contour powder, you have to probably pay like seven, eight, nine dollars for like one thing, but you are paying nine dollars and you are getting three of them. This is a steal. So if you haven't got this palette yet, you have to. This is so so good. Next time that I've been enjoying lately is this Maybelline uh, Master Fix Makeup Setting Spray, and I got it like two weeks ago, and I was not really expecting much from this makeup setting spray because i have not seen so many people talking about this spray and i've been planning to do a like one brand makeup tutorial that's why i got this and i was like surprised with the quality this reminds me so much of my uh, l'oreal infallible makeup extender and you have if you have been watching me for a while you must know that that one is my number one makeup setting spray all time i love that makeup setting spray and this reminds me so much of my l'oreal one packaging is quite similar and the finish is also quite similar 
it just sets my makeup beautifully it makes my makeup long lasting and it just melts down everything and makes everything like skin like and this is what i am like wearing right now on my face and this is so so good if you spot this one at walmart or walgreens just grab it this is so so good the mist is so fine as you can see and it has a chemical kind of a smell and you know what the smell is even quite similar to the l'oreal one and i do not mind that i do not have sensitive nose so yeah i'm okay with and the smell does not linger for so long so if you have a sensitive nose this will not be a problem for you it lasts for about 30 seconds and then it just completely goes away so yeah that should not be a problem go for it it is a very nice makeup setting spray and the next product I cannot rave enough about it and this is the elf a metallic flare highlighter and this is in the shade white gold nobody can tell you this is only for six dollars the quality is so good I mean look at the uh, design kind of a thing over here and look at this this is so so stunning when you touch it it's a bit stiff it is not very smooth but very smooth kind of texture it's a bit stiff and if you use this kind of fan brush this kind of thin fan brush it's not gonna work trust me it's not gonna work you have to use either your finger or a dense highlighting brush like this and this just gives your face a very nice glow like perfect it's it's so blinding you know and it lasts on me all day long it is just perfect highlighter i am in love with this highlighter i cannot rave enough about it this is so good and it is so inexpensive oh my god the color is just perfect if you spot any of them just grab it these highlighters are so good and i have not really seen so many people talking about these highlighters i do not know why but the quality is really really amazing so you have to have to try this one this is just perfect next i have here an eyeshadow palette and you guys probably know which eyeshadow palette i'm gonna talk about this profusion cosmetics eyeshadow palette in the shade wanderlust look at this look at the colors isn't it so gorgeous I mean this is only for $10 trust me this is only for $10 and I was not expecting this quality from a $10 palette look at the pigmentation can you see it is just one swipe trust me and the metallic shades and shimmer shades in this palette they are equally good just one swipe that's all you need the pigmentation is so good they are not powdery they are not patchy the blendability is awesome it just blends beautifully there is only one shade this shade called go girl this is a stunning shade but it stains my eyes yes only this shade stains my eyes other than that just the shades are beautiful I love colorful palettes and these are beautiful you have those neutral shades to create a neutral look you have so many colors to play around this is such a nice palette if you haven't got them yet just go and get it I'm planning to get some more palettes from profusion because the quality is so good and I have already done three makeup tutorials using this palette I will link all of them at the end of this video so please go ahead and check that out you can clearly see how pigmented they are how buildable how blendable they are the quality and everything you can clearly make out what i'm talking about so please go ahead and check the, those videos out so yeah i have that amazing product next i have here this maybelline fit me blush in rose or rose clear I got it from Walmart and I instantly fell in love with this blush. This is like a mauve pink color and perfect for my skin tone. It gives a very nice subtle kind of a color and it's not a matte blush. It has a sheen to it though it's not as shimmery or as shiny as my Milani Luminoso 
but it has a nice sheen to it it is something in between and the color is to die for i mean you can layer it up for like a nighttime party makeup or if you're wearing in a day-to-day -day basis you just we are like one or two layers maybe and you are good to go this gives my cheeks a nice hint of color it is just perfect and most importantly it lasts on my cheeks for a really really long time because you know what blush is the first thing that leaves your face but with this blush it does not happen it lasts on me for a really really long time and i love that about this blush next i have here another blush and this is from nyx this is the nyx hd blush in electra and this blush is again so so good look at this it is a hot pink color and you have to be really really careful while using this blush let me tune the light a bit so can so that you can see the actual color and this is the actual color this is a hot pink color you have to be really really careful while using this blush now if you are a very nice muted blush kind of person you you are not gonna like this one but i love this blush this is so richly pigmented the, this blends beautifully and i specifically love this blush for my bridal makeups and whenever i'm doing any night out party makeup or i'm going out at night i love wearing this blush it looks perfect on me and i just apply a very thin layer of this blush and it looks amazing on my skin so if you are my skin tone or darker than me go for it this blush is so good we are making a progress i have only three lip products to share with you and i freaking love each of them each of them they are so so good first i have here this uh, flower beauty miracle matte lipstick in the shade which shade it is rosewood i believe yes this is in the shade rosewood first of all the color it is the perfect nude lipstick for my skin tone and i love the formula of these lipsticks this is not drying at all this is so comfortable on my lips and when i apply this lipstick on my lips it gives a very nice cooling sensation which i absolutely love and it lasts on my lips for a really really long time i mean say about seven to eight hours and it is transfer proof it does not transfer whatsoever if i eat or if i drink it does not transfer and i love the color i love the formula this has been my go-to lipstick for this entire month so yeah if you're looking for a good liquid lipstick that does not dry out your lips that does not emphasize any texture that lasts for a really long period of time then go for it this is so good next lipstick is again from flower beauty and this is their petal pout lip color in the shade pink dusk again i have been loving this lipstick lately this is a nude lipstick and it is perfect for my skin tone if you are my skin tone give it a shot this is going to be your perfect nude shade formula is so creamy it glides on my lips smoothly it does not emphasize any texture and since it is a um, cream formula it does transfer i'm not saying that it is transfer proof it does transfer and it does not have a matte finish though i am a matte lipstick lover but nowadays i'm like i'm leaning more towards creamy formula and i feel like the trend of glossy lipstick is coming back and this lipstick i love to wear this lipstick this is so so comfortable to wear i just love the formula of this lipstick so if you're looking for a good comfortable bullet lipstick then give it a shot you are gonna love this formula trust me and the pigmentation is so smooth it is so opaque you know what i have tried some uh, lipsticks from the drugstore but i love this formula way better than them i love this formula way better than my maybelline uh, color statement matte lipsticks or color sensational matte lipsticks like the touch of spice nude tones i love this one more than those maybelline lipsticks the formula is so good 
Now last but not least I have one more lipstick and the formula really really surprised me when I first time used this lipstick and I'm talking about this Rimmel London Stay Satin Lipstick in the shade Radical. This is a gorgeous red color and I featured it in my uh, top 10 red lipstick video if you haven't watched that video yet click on the link over there to watch that video this formula is so so surprising to me it goes on smoothly it is nicely pigmented and it does not emphasize any texture on my lips whatsoever i just love the formula of this lipstick the day when i was trying it out when i first applied it it was a glossy kind of a lipstick and after like two to three minutes it settled down to be a complete satin lipstick and it is a satin lipstick which i absolutely agree and it was transferring crazily trust me when i was drinking or eating it was transferring crazily and i was like oh my god this lipstick is not gonna last on my lips but i was shocked after like six hours when i checked it on the mirror the pigmentation was spot on. I had been wearing this lipstick for 6 hours and it was looking so fresh and it was like I just applied this lipstick and after like 4 hours it became completely matte. So yeah I love the formula of this, this lipsticks. If you haven't tried them yet you should because I'm sure you are gonna love this one. So yeah go ahead and try this. So finally the video ends here and I hope you guys enjoyed it and I hope this video was helpful for you and if you enjoyed watching this video then please hit the like button and please share this video with your friends and family and let them know about my channel and if you are not uh, following me on Facebook, Instagram and Twitter please do follow me there all the links will be given in the description bar down below so please go ahead and check that out so yeah see you soon in my next one till then bye and take care.